version 1.0 of this program was kind of rushed because well um let's just say this forum kind of wanted a background program huh so here we are with nocturnal hour developers editor version 1.1 this is a bug fix version with many many new things, for example the useless stuff no one cares about like adding more music into the jukebox or to the stuff where I actually care about which is actually um, ensuring uh, that a certain bug is fixed in the vertex editor to ensure you don't enter garbage. <laughs> yes, there are a lot, a lot of things in version 1.1 and I'll try to cover them as quickly as possible. Alrighty, alrighty. So now manual, manual importing is now added with a possibility of adding um, decimal points and all that jazz. Uh, you probably won't care unless you're a crazy accurate freak. Um, besides that, we have o I have also added a uh, editing mode which enables you to flip the vertices vertically, horizontally, reverse the path list and delete them all in one shot. Ain't that swell. Also, I, I'm not sure if I mentioned this last time, but there's a pause button. So yes, and then there's all the Udra stuff. Since I deleted everything, it's gone, blah blah blah. Uh, the help file is now 16 pages long. I, I hope you actually bothered reading this thing. Uh, I've added a configuration menu for you to save and switch volume in case you don't want volume. Uh, quality mode which affects anti-aliasing and the best part is it actually saves this so if I were to quit the program right now like so and reopen it it will save the settings just like before so yes this actually uses cookies and all that stuff so that's pretty much it for Nocturnal Hour Developers Editor version 1.1. I pretty much covered everything I have to cover. There are a lot of minor bug fixes, but no one really cares about them but the programmer. Although you should, but alas, alas the indie. So, uh, once again, download link is in the description. I will link the forum thread in the uh, description as well. So. Hope you download this version and get rid of version 1.0 because that version is quickly becoming obsolete.